Hello friends, in this session we will talk about how we can create the grouping of visualization into Power BI Desktop. With that we will also talk about the purpose of creating the group and how it is useful in our report development process. So now let's get started. So first of all this is my Power BI report and I have different visualization placed into my report. I have filter pen, uh, filter pen on the left hand side. I have some visualization like uh, this donut chart, this map visualization, table visualization and different type of gauges in my report now I want to create a group for my slicer pen for so for that what I need to do here is first I need to turn on the selection pen so first of all go to your view menu and open the selection pen so you can see here the selection pen has been opened on the right hand side now I need to select my visualization so I have selected this visualization and you can see the gray color uh, into my selection pen now uh, I, need, I I am selecting the other visualization as well let's say say T slicer I am selecting order date I am selecting product name so you can see here all the highlighted slicers over here and at last I am selecting this year slicer as well now I want to create a group for all of these slicers so I am right clicking over here group and click on group option so you can see here it created one group and under that particular group all five slicers are available so you can see here all the five slicers are available into that particular group section now one more thing over here let's say whenever we create a group it just create one uh, outline of uh, all of this uh, five slicer so using this that particular outline you can easily resize your visualization so it saves your lots of time so for an example if i uh, just resize my group so with that particular resizing option all the inside slicer would automatically uh, change its size so this is really really amazing feature so sometimes there are situations where in your report you have so many text boxes so many slicers and so many small elements available on your page and uh, if you do not group it uh, with a group section uh, uh, for a smaller change you need to spend so many time like uh, if 5 pixel or 6 pixel change you want to do in all your slicers you need to select manually and uh, need to change the properties but with this option it is becoming very easy all right so uh, this is the thing about the grouping one more thing let's say uh, on my page i have this gauge visualization as well and i want to uh, create a group group for my gauges as well so i'm creating this group uh, as a group too now uh, let's say in your page you have used some bookmark and selection pen and uh, let's say on button click uh, you want to hide some of the slicer or you want to hide some of the gauges so uh, with this grouping property uh, let's say if you hide this gauges all the gauges from that particular group would be hidden so this is really really amazing now let's say listing of group is also possible so let's say i have two groups right now group one and group and i want to merge that as a single group uh, at the root so at that time i just need to right click on it and uh, create a group as well for that so you can see here group three has been created and under the group three we have the two listed group under it now one more thing let's say if you don't wish to have the group for a visualization or if you want to remove the grouping in the visualization then you just need to right click on the group and select ungroup option so this would be ungrouped let's see if i want to ungroup this as well so i will just click on this ungroup option all right so this is how we can easily uh, manage the group into power bi visualization this saves our lots of time in the designing part or a ui part also it help us to uh, manage our things very easily when we are going with a bookmark pen or a selection pen or we want to show hide visualization based on some conditions and all so this is really very useful feature so hope this is clear for you now if you have any question related to this grouping of visualization 
you can uh, share your uh, opinion with me in the comment section as well as you can email me on uh, uh, dhruvinsha16 at gmail.com or you can also whatsapp me on plus 919537981467 also if you are for the first time to my channel hit the subscribe button and press the bell notification to never miss any updates from my channel also you can follow me on all social media platform like facebook linkedin twitter and whatsapp also uh, if you want to receive the daily notification from my channel you just uh, click on this form fill up this for it will redirect you to this this particular form fill the form so you will be receiving the daily whatsapp notification or your mobile number stay connected with me have a great day goodbye